welcome back. I have a haul from Simon Says Stamp and it's a bunch of Timmy stuff. So if you haven't ordered from Simon Says Stamp, um, obviously they have their own brand, which I'm sure you guys have heard of, but they do carry lots of other brands on their website. So I ordered from them because there was something specific to me that I wanted. And when I was doing my scrapbook.com order that I showed you, I think last week, they didn't have said product because I think it's discontinued. So it's just like whatever, whatever companies have, you know, left in their stock. Um, also my dog is drinking water behind me. So that's what that noise is. So I went on there, they had it, and of course I got some other things. So I'm gonna share with you what I got from Simon Says Tim. And it's, I think, everything in here is Tim. All right, first of all, this is a restock. Um, this is the, and I'm gonna save this packaging for my whatnot orders. Sorry about the shadows. I mess with the lighting forever. It's, you know, what time is it? 6.30 in the morning, it's like rainy outside. I, you know. I'm sorry, <laughs> it's not the best. But I got the collage medium. I really, really like this stuff. I'm almost out. I do prefer it over a Mod Podge. Um, and not just because it's Timmy, but because I actually like the product. And it really isn't Timmy, it's just Ranger, right? Anyways, I like the product better than Mod Podge. Um, the other product that I do like that's similar is, I actually think I, this. Maker's Magic. I only had the gloss, although I think they recently came out with a matte. And so I do want to grab at the matte and see if they compare, because this one's matte and this one's gloss. Um, I want to see how they compare to each other because I'm guessing ounce for ounce, this is probably a better buy, but I'd have to do the math. I'm not really sure. So I, w I do want to try that. So I got that. Then... Let's see. Okay. I got some more collage paper. I love using this and this one. Okay. I love birds. Um, so this one has birds. Let's take a little look. See, look. Birds over top of music notes. Come on now. So if you've never worked with this, it's kind of like tissue paper, but you can collage with it. Look how pretty that is. So love it okay that's gonna be really fun i'll have to show you guys actually i have something specifically in mind for this so that should be coming up all right next i got this ink i do not have this um and i saw to me using it in a recent youtube live i think it was when he was talking about the spritz the new spritzes um, and I wanted to try this one. I have archival ink, but I don't have the distressed one. So I don't know I mean, I have black soot in distress ink or distress oxide. I'm not sure, but anyways, I wanted to try that out. Then I've been wanting these stamps. I think it's called ticket booth. Yes. Ticket booth. Three, three, seven. So that's got all these little fun tickets. This looks like a time card or something. Maybe like a travel schedule, I guess. Um, fun. Oh, Paramount Theater. I love it. And then to go with those, yes, I did. You know what's coming. You know what's coming. And this is not even the stuff, the thing that I actually went um, to buy. But if I was gonna get a stamps, then obviously I need to get the dies, right? So I was trying to explain this to my husband. He's like, I don't get it. Like, I don't understand what this does with this, but you all know. Stamp this and then you can cut them out with the dies, the matching dies. So that's gonna be fun. Okay, this is another die set that I have been, I've looked at it, had it in my cart, took it out of my cart, looked at the, Timu version, all this, but I ended up getting it. Um, so this set cuts out all of these things, and I'm very excited to use this. So many fun little thingamajig in here. I love this. 
So yeah. All right, then I grabbed some more. Oh no, okay. This, I wanna open this. So this is a little journal that we can decorate. It's made from fabric and basically I also wanted to see how it was constructed to see if I could make one from some of the Timmy fabric I have on hand. And um, yeah, I think I can. I mean, this is really just pages sewn together. This is heavier than like the Timmy fabric though. So this is really fun. Okay. And this wasn't very much. It was $6.99. Um, but as you can see here, they put this cool little... Uh, I like that idea of sliding this little key thing. I have to think I had these. Not not the Timmy ones. I think I have some Graphic 45 ones. But um, a stitch canvas journal ideal for mixed media. So you could probably paint in here, use sprays, ink, stays on ink, collage, all kinds of fun stuff. Just like fun to, fun to work with. So that will be fun. Okay. Then I got, this is what I thought I had pulled out before. This is more collage paper. It's basically the same, just this one's on a roll and these are sheets. So this is 30 sheets. So you get these designs. I mean, you could probably Mod Podge a sheet right onto this cover. So these are like, I'm sorry about the, uh, the uh, dogs, they're playing. They're always so squirrely in the morning. They got the zoomies and they like to wrestle and bark at each other. Um, so anyways, this, this one has all of these designs. So it's got like some florals, um, some words, you got some birds, the moths, all kinds of fun stuff in there. I guess that's a better picture. And then this one has these cool numbers, like some newsprint looking things, some type typewriter key looks like almost. And these, I don't remember how much these were, not very much. Um, and then I grabbed this mirrored cardstock. Uh, and remember, this has a protective film on it. So I thought this would be fun. Oh, it's adhesive back. Didn't even realize that. Ooh, okay. So that's a cool. Then I got another snippet pad. I love using these. There's lots of cool little snippets. <laughs> it's aptly named, but um, you can just add these to different projects and it's very fun. If you haven't tried one of these. And then I grabbed this embossing folder. Let's check this out. Um, little globes. This is one of the new ones, I believe. I think this just came out. Um, Mm -hmm. I don't see a date. I think it's new though. Yeah. Oh, no, it's not. 2014. Why did I think it was new? Mm. Well, anyways, it's got globes on it. So I thought that would be cool with like some travel themed journals or cards or whatever, tags, whatever you want to do. I'm not going to try to put it back in there. Okay. And the thing that I actually went for because they, I heard they're discontinuing it and I've never even tried it. I got two packages are these. Hello. Okay. These are like acetate sheets kind of, but they, they're called shattered windows. I feel like these would be so cool behind obviously like little window frames or door frames. And it looks like it's shattered. So um, very grungy, very cool. I am really excited to use these. And also to maybe figure out if I can make them myself. I don't know, could we, could we figure that out? I feel like we could, but there's feels like there's a lot in here. Um, how many are in here? 20 pieces. So I got two packages. These weren't, if I had to guess without looking at my receipt, they were like, six dollars I'm not sure but I feel like that's 40 sheets that's probably gonna be more than enough and that is everything so I mean that is a fun fun Timmy haul right so many fun things that I've been wanting to try um so yeah I hope you enjoyed yet another Timmy haul and check out Simon Says Stamp they even on the other side of this is a coupon for five dollars off my next order that's how they keep you coming back it's like Cole's cash. It's like a cycle. You have to keep going back. <laughs> Anyways, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.